Welcome back fellow reefers. It is Christmas Eve and boy do I have a gift for all of you. I'd like to say thank you to all of my subscribers, all the dedicated viewers that comment, my subscribers who comment all the time. So my gift to you is I'm going to recite the night before Christmas, but in a reef keepers version. Grab your PJs, grab it some hot chocolate, some hot cocoa, and let's go. Twas the night before Christmas, and all through the fish room. Not a single tang was awake, not even a shroom. All of the test kits were placed on the shelves with care in hope that more reagents would soon be there. The mandarins were all nestled, all snug in their beds, while visions of copepods danced in their heads. Mom in her kerchief and I in my cap had just settled down for a long winter's nap. When down in the fish room there arose such a clatter, I sprang from my bed to see what was the matter. Away to the fish room, I flew with a flash tore open the canopy and said, there goes all my cash. The light from the Kessels shining brightly in the water's flow gave a luster of midday spectrum below. When what to my wandering eye should appear, but Santa himself with an apex and new gear. Now Dasher, now Dancer, now Prancer and Vixen, on Comet, on Cupid, on Donner and Blitzen. To the top of the porch, to the top of the wall, now dash away, dash away, dash away all. As dry leaves that before the wild hurricane fly, when they meet with an obstacle, mount to the sky. So up to the housetop, the coursers they flew with a sleigh full of reef gear in St. Nicholas too. And then in a twinkling, I heard on the roof the prancing and pawing of each little hoof. As I drew in my hand and I was turning around, down the chimney St. Nicholas came with a bound. He was covered in reefroids from his head to his feet. All his clothes were all tarnished with red sea treat. An array of frags he flung on his back, and he looked like a vendor just opening his sack. His eyes how they twinkled, his dimples how merry, his cheeks were like roses, his nose like pearl berry. His droll little mouth was drawn up like a bow, and the beard of his chin was as white as reef snow. The stump of a pipe he held tight in his teeth and the smoke it encircled his head like a wreath. He had a broad face and a little round belly that shook when he laughed like a euphilia with brown jelly. He was chubby and plump a right jolly old elf, 
and I laughed when I saw him in spite of myself. A wink of his eye and a twist of his head soon gave me to know my aquarium had nothing to dread. He spoke not a word, but went straight to his work and filled all the two part, then turned with a jerk. In laying his finger aside of his nose and giving a nod up the chimney he rose. He sprang to his sleigh, to his team gave a whistle, and away they all flew like the down of a thistle. But I heard him exclaim as he drove out of sight, Merry Christmas to all, and to all a good night. So from our family to yours, Merry, Merry Christmas. Christmas.